In this video, we're going to take a look at three different ribbon microphones that represent three different price points. Starting out on the end here is the MXL R144. It's a fairly straightforward and inexpensive ribbon microphone. It has a short ribbon element that is 1.5 microns thick, and the microphone features a bi-directional or figure eight pickup pattern. Moving next up the line into a more of a mid-priced option is the Cascade Fathead 2. It also has a short ribbon element, uh, but what separates it from the MXL is that the ribbon's a little thicker. It's 2.5 microns thick, and it also is loaded with a Lundahl transformer. Then moving up to our higher priced option here is the Shure KSM 313NE. This microphone is packed with a few different features compared to the other two. Now Shure doesn't directly divulge if this is a short ribbon element or how thick the ribbon is, but they do divulge that it is made of their own proprietary material, which is called Roswellite. Whereas the R144 and the Fathead 2 feature aluminum ribbons, the Roswellite ribbon offers some high tensile strength and superior shape memory, meaning that the KSM 313NE can handle very high SPLs, in fact, up to 146 decibels. So you could safely use this to mic a kick drum on a loud drummer, whereas with the other two microphones here, I would probably use a little caution with that, depending on the drummer. One other feature that distinguishes the KSM 313NE from other ribbon microphones is that it features Shure's dual voice motor assembly. Basically what this means is that you get two different tonal voicings depending on which side of the mic you're addressing. If you address the front side, it's a warmer sonic signature. If you're addressing the rear, it's a little bit brighter. The KSM 313NE also features a custom wound double shielded transformer for superior noise rejection, rejecting RF interference, and also maximizing the output level of the microphone. So we're gonna hear these mics on a few different sources. We're gonna start out with a voiceover demo. Then we'll move to mono drums, a very simple drum set. Then we'll hear electric guitar, and then lastly, bass. This is a voiceover demo of the MXL R144 ribbon microphone. The quick brown fox jumped over the lazy dog. This is a voiceover demo of the Cascade Fathead 2 ribbon microphone. The quick brown fox jumped over the lazy dog. This is a voiceover demo of the Shure KSM 313NE ribbon microphone. The quick brown fox jumped over the lazy dog.
If you're interested in checking out any of these Rubin microphones or any other recording gear, head on over to AmericanMusical.com.